All right, everyone. This is Dr. Ahmed Ergin, founder of Sugar MDs. Today, we are going to talk about the carbohydrates. So, the carbohydrates that you are going to eat during the holidays. You have diabetes? Tune in. We are going to talk about the holiday trees today. Okay, let's talk about details, guys. Eggnog is around 300 calories and 36 grams of carbs and 30 grams of sugar. Hot chocolate, 192 calories for one cup and 27 grams of carbs, 24 grams of sugar. A large gingerbread cookie can cost you 50 grams, 59 grams actually carbs and 22 grams of sugar. Now the fruit cake is, uh, if you just want to get a piece of it, it's 26 grams of carbs and 30 14 grams of sugar. Now, candy cane, 14 grams of carbs, 14 grams of sugar, a little better. A peppermint bark, I'm sure you love it too, 20 grams of carbs and 19 grams of sugar. The pumpkin pie is around 36 grams per, per serving and 16 grams of sugar. And the sweet potato pie, which is favored a lot, especially in South, is 43 grams of carbs and 22 grams of sugar. Pecan pie is around 76 grams of carbs. Uh, that's a little crazy. 37 grams of sugar right there. The chocolate chip cookies are a little bit better. You can have a few of those. 12 grams of carbs and 7 grams of sugar. Now the sugar cookies for one cookie is around 12 grams as well. Now if you want to have some dinner rolls, that's around 16 grams of carbs and 4 grams of sugar. Now think about this. If you if you want to have a piece of everything, you're going to end up with 200 grams of sugar. That can, that can shoot you to the sky. Now, green bean casserole is 17 grams of carbs and 8 grams of fat. Mac and cheese. It's a little bit savory, right? Well, typically when I eat sweet, I want to have some salt right after that. So one cup is around 54 grams of carbs and 13 grams of saturated fat and over 900 milligrams of sodium. Now, potato latke is 13 grams of carbs and some fat is a go with it and and it's 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 that's for pretty much like a medium sized latke now the wines pinot noir is around 3.4 grams cabernet is 3.8 pinot grigio is around uh, 5 Moscato is 11.4 you name it this is only for five ounces of a drink and the sweeter the wine the more the carbs in there and the dry wines will be always a better choice now this was a quick summary for you and we have a lot more details. If you want to learn more about it, please go to our blog and click the link right here. If you want to subscribe, please sub subscribe to our channel. We will have a lot more videos coming and that's going to be very informational. This is going to help you manage your diabetes and we are always happy to help you in managing your diabetes. So if you have any questions, please email us or call us at sugarmds.com and have a happy holiday.